Welcome everyone, this gray shirt guy, rocking the gray shirt as always. Okay, yeah, it's a it's a lie. I'm I'm not wearing a gray shirt. But either way, uh, apologies if you hear the air conditioner in the background. Um, I'm sorry. I should be able to edit out in a post, but if not, um, you're just gonna have to deal with it because it's freaking hot. It's like 91, and humidity is pretty much 100% here. Uh, we're opening ourselves a box of Kaladesh. What am I looking for? Chandra. Torch of Defiance is what I'm looking for. But any invention, I'm happy with. And I don't know. I only open a cup. I'd say I open maybe about 20 of these uh, in total since I started. Uh, I pretty much I came back to Magic right when Aether Revolt came out. So I did have a little bit of Kaladesh in some of the drafts, but mostly Aether Revolt. So every time I pull an Aether Revolt, it just it just makes me sad. Uh, I do have a box of Aether Revolt, which is funny how it's like the last box I'm going to open until Hour Devastation. Uh, but you may have already seen the Hour Devastation video beforehand because of the wonders of YouTube and editing. But either way, let's open the Kaladesh. Let's see what we got. Burr, burr, burr. Yeah. yeah. Um. <laughs> Blossoming Defense. Engineered Might. Speedway Fanatic and Fleetwheel Cruiser. All right, what's this thing do? Trample, haste. When it enters the battlefield, it becomes an artifact creature until on turn. Oh, okay. All right, so you don't need a uh, uh, you don't need a crew the first turn to bring it out. Not bad, not bad. Don't know if I had that. Well, let's keep on going. Let's see if we can get any of those sweet inventions. Oh. Uh. Furious Reprisal, Mister or Ministry of Inquiries, Armored Craft Judge, and an, electro, an electrostatic pummeler. All right, when it enters the battlefield, you get three energy. Pay three energy. It gets plus X plus X until on turn where X is its power. All right, and a foil Fireforge Puzzle Nut. Ooh, we got ourselves a Nissa token. Is Nissa in this set? I don't. Oh yeah, she is in this set. Okay, I wouldn't mind getting a Nissa. I'm really more looking for a Chandra than a Nissa. Bum, bum, bum. Another Furious Reprisal. Uh, Fretwork Colony. Uh, what is this? Gifara's Gifar? I don't know. It's a guide and a territorial gerger. It's got trample. Whenever you get one or more energy, it gets plus two, plus two on the turn. So, meh, all right. Boop, 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 boop. What do we get? We got an oh, let's see, oval chase dragster. Hazardous conditions. Creatures with no counters on them get minus two, minus two until on turn. Okay. Uh, glimmer of genius and torrential gear hulk. Nice. Oh, we got a foil authority of co of consoles. Let, let me read this one real quick. Creatures your opponent control enter the battlefield tapped. Nice. Ooh. When a creature enters the battlefield under your, an opponent's control, you gain one life. What? Oh, this is going in my commander deck. Like, yes. Oh, that's in the foil. That's a foil also. But let's see how much. Uh, actually, how much is that? Let's see. Let's see what our prices is. We're currently using TCG player pricing. And as with the other videos, these came from Rudy over at Alpha Investments. Just want to give him a shout out. Tarantula Gear Hulk, $21 still. I don't know if that's going to stay $21 um, with the changes in the meta and everything. Um, I don't know about the other card. No, nope. doesn't look like uh, doesn't look like Authority of Consoles is on here, but I'm definitely probably going to use it. We've got a Mythic. All right, let's keep going. Yeah. Oh, they're going to enter tapped and again in life every time you bring a creature up. That's pure win for me. We got a Long Tusk Cub, a Visionary Augmenter, Perpetual Timepiece, and ooh, an Inspiring Vantage. Uh, this is worth four bucks. All right, cool. I have one of those already. Got it in my... Um, Enders Battlefield tapped unless you control two or, more, two or fewer other lands. Okay. Not bad. So early game, it comes into play untapped. Oh, wait. Oh. I think I played that wrong last time. So I think I played it tapped. Uh, let's see. Deconcoction module. Whirler maker, maker. Quick Smith Genius and Fateful Showdown. What's this do? 
Faithful Showdown deals damage to target creature or player equal to the number of cards in your hand. Discard all cards in your hand, then draw that many cards. Okay. So, could do nothing? Or something? I don't know. Chief of the Foundry. I got so many of these. Uh, Whirler Vert Vertusio. I don't know how to say that. Uh, Malfist Doorbuster and a Botanical Sanctum. We got Harness Lightning, Fabrication Module, Trusted Companion, and Fumigates. Uh, that's pretty nice. I got one of these in my Commander deck. Fumigates, Fumigates on my list, right? Yeah, Fumigates worth a couple bucks, two bucks. Oh, Harness Lighting's also worth two bucks. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Iron League Steed, Diabolic Tutor, Start Your Engines, and Dubious Challenge. Look at the top 10 cards of your library. Exile up to two creature cards from your library among them. Then shuffle your library. Target opponent may choose one of the exiled cards and put it on the battlefield under, your, under his or her control. Put the rest on the battlefield under your control. What? Uh, oh. No, I don't want to do that. That's lame. I guess that's why they call it a dubious challenge. Mm -hmm. uh, essence Extraction, Spark of Creativity, Snare Thopter, and a Bristling Hydra. I got a few of these. I think now I have a playset. And a Built to Smash Foil. Built to Smash. Uh, bristling Hydra is two bucks. All right. I can see where, you know, gaining Hexproof until then turns pretty sweet. You can get a 1 1 counter on him, especially if you're pumping a lot of energy into him. Sky Whaler Snot or Shot, <laughs> Bombat uh, Bazaar Barge, Quick Smith Genius, and a uh, Gifferper Ornery. Uh, each player may pay additional land on his or her turn. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, if that player has no cards in hand, draw that player draws three cards. Okay, Make Obsolete Foil. I have one of those. I've never used it though. Is it worth anything? I don't think it is. No, no, it's not. Oh, apparently that... No, that's a different one. I didn't get that one. Unlicensed Disintegration. Nice. Uh, Consulate Surveillance, Armored Craft Judge, and Angel of Invention. Okay. Interesting. Five mana. Flying Vigilance Lifelink. Nice. Fabricate two and other creatures you control get plus one, plus one. Yes. Yes. Uh, that's nice. That might go in my commander deck. I don't know how much it's worth. I don't think it's really worth anything. I don't really see it on here. Oh, no, it is worth two bucks. It's still a nice card, especially flying vigilance and lifelink. Nice. And it could be a four, it could be a four, three. If you fabricate onto itself, uh, demolition stomper, nature's way, John at century and a uh, cultivator caravan tap at one man of any color to your mana pool. Crew three is a five, five. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I make mana and I do damage. Or, and I can attack for five. <laughs> Aether Torch Renegade, Ceremonious Rejection, Aether Hub, and a, confisca a Confiscation Coup, which I got in a pack like last week, which I'm not going to read it out loud. I'm not impressed. It's not what I'm looking for. Aetherworks Marvel is still. I guess Aetherworks Marvel is in modern. And I don't. I don't know. I, I know it was banned in standard, but I don't know if it was banned in modern. Fretwork Colony. Servo Exhibition. Deba Diabolic Tutor and Insidious Will. Uh, choose so four mana. Choose one counter target spell. You may choose new targets for target spell. Copy target instance or source spell. You may choose new targets. Yeah. A lot of mana to do that. That's why it's a rare, not a mythic. Mm 
Uh, Weaponcraft Enthusiasts, uh, Emperial Voyager, Aether Meltdown, and a Bombat Courier. One of my friends traded for all my Bombat Couriers. I don't know. Maybe maybe he wants one more. I don't know. Uh, and a Foil Malfus Doorbuster. Okay. Am I not going to get a Planeswalker? I didn't get a Planeswalker in, my, in last week's box either. Maybe sad. Aerial Responder, Blossoming Defense, Console Shield Guard, and a Potom Console of Innovation. Oh, no, 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 no. You, you are uncommon. You go in the uncommon stack. Artifacts you control have hexproof. Okay. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you control an artifact, the artifact with the highest converted mana cost or tied for the highest matter converted mana cost, draw a card. Impress me. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to fix my stack here. My stack's getting all unruly. Make obsolete. Oh, this is a rare. Why did I put it in the incoming area? Uh, Glint Nest Crane, Restoration Gearsmith, and a Skyship Stalker. Hmm. 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 Yeah. It's okay. Yeah, come on. Okay, here we go. Right now, I'm more worried about Chandra than any invention cards. Nature's Way, Experimental Aviator, Brazen Scourge, and Master Tinkerer. Uh, we got a Dwarf Artificer. Servos and, servos and Thopters get plus one, plus one, and you can create a colorless servo artifact creature or token. Okay. That's pretty cool if you're making Thopters and tokens and stuff like that. Essence Extraction, Contraband Kingspin, Minister of Inquiries, and Captured by the Consulate. All right, so what's this do? This is a chant creature you don't control. Enchant creatures can't attack. When an opponent casts a spell, if it's a single target, change the target to enchant creature of Able. Damn. At last, the infamous Pia Nalar. Okay. That's pretty sweet. I mean, it's four mana, but you can lock it something down. Foundry Inspector. Voltanic, or Vault, Voltic Brawler. Uh, Jeanette Sentry. And a Scrappy Scounder. I got a couple of these in a red black deck I made. I think that's still two bucks. Um, I don't have the green gear Hulk. That'd be pretty nice. The verdant green Hulk. That'd be nice to get. Doo, 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 doo. Engineering, engineered mites, creeping molds, glimmer of genius, and cultivator of blades. I traded all my cultivator blades away because I wasn't using them. Okay. Bombab, a bazaar, or bazaar, bra, with a lot of bees. Uh, Fairground, Trumpeter, Era of Innovation, and Lost Legacy. That's just freaking, oh, man. I don't know. This box is not singing to me. This box is the opposite of singing. I mean, aside from the Tarantula Gearhawk, I'm just, I'm not, I'm not feeling it. Cloud Blazer, Iron, Se Iron League Stead, Ceremonies Rejection, and Madcap Experiments. What's this guy do? Reveal top card, reveal cards from the top of your library until you reveal an artifact card. Put the card on the battlefield and the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Madcap experimental deals damage to you equal to the number of cards revealed this way. Okay. Or deals damage to you. Oh, ow. No. If it dealt damage to the enemy, it'd be good. Not to me. I guess that could be like super broken though. I'm going to put one artifact in my deck. Mer. Underhand Design, Trusted Companion, Whirler Maker, and, oh, a Panharmonica. That's worth two bucks. All right. If an artifact or creature entering the battlefield causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger, that ability triggers an additional thing. Yep. I got one of those. I never used it. Or I used it, but I, like, completely misunderstood what it was, so it actually didn't help me at all. Deconcoction Module. Hazardous or yeah, hazardous conditions, consulate surveillance, and a goatee, Lord of Luxury. Okay, what's this? 
Uh, there's a lot of words. We got a legendary creature, Aetherborn Rogue, Death Touch. When it enters the battlefield, look at the top five cards of target opponent's library. Exile one of them face down. Then put the rest on the bottom of that library in a random order. For as long as that card remains exiled, you may look at it. You may cast it, and you may spend mana as though it were mana of any type to cast it. Okay. You, I like how it says you may look at it, and you may cast it. <laughs> you can look at it all you want, or you can cast it. Sky Swirler here. I'm not reading the comments. I don't know why I started reading the comments. Okay. Long Tusk Cub. Ballista Charger. Uh, Inventor's uh, Apprentice. And... Let's see, we got Olvilla, Pashara, Sage Lifecrafter, Legendary Creature, Human Artificer, Pay 3 tap, create a 1 1 colorless servo artifact creature token, Pay 5 tap, create an XX colorless construct creature token where X is the number of creatures you control. Okay, could be useful. We're getting low on packs, ladies and gents, I don't know. I don't know if you don't get the win like early, I don't, I'm feeling uncomfortable. Foundry Inspector, Incendiary Sabotage, Refurbish, and a Deadlock Trap. What a shit rare. I mean, it might be good, but I don't like it. It's not what I'm looking for. Oh, you could have bought the singles. I know. I know I could have bought the singles, but what's the point of making a video if you're not going to open it? Come along for the ride. Longfin Sky Whale, Disappearing Act, Creeping Mold, and a Spire Bluff Canal. Meh. That's worth something. What is that worth? Nine bucks. Okay. And a foil impeccable timing. All right. Okay. I mean, I'm not going to say no to value. Will it always be worth nine bucks? Ah, no idea. Probably not. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Aerial responder. Ballista charger. Durable handicraft. And an aether storm rock, which is a giant bird. Flying when it enters the battlefield. Well, when, it, when Aether Rock or another creature enters the battlefield under your control, you get one energy. Okay. Whenever it attacks, you may pay two. If you do, put a 1-1 one, one creature, a 1-1 one, one counter on it and tap up to one target creature. Oh, okay. All right. That, that's not bad. Not a bad card. Got a decent rare for once. Weapons Crass Enthusiast. Another Virtual... Elegant Edge Crafter and an Aetherworks Marvel, which I have like three of these. And what is it worth? Like four bucks right now? I'm like not impressed. I'm not going to get what I want out of this box. I just I just feel it. I just feel like this box just, just hosed me right now. Uh, Long Fend of Sky Whale, Servo Expedition, Sequestered Stash, and Malformed Wanderer. Artifact creature construct, air's battlefield to get three energy. Pay one. Gains your choice of flying, vigilance, or life length on the turn. Okay. Uh, pay one. It's plus two, minus two, or minus two, plus two until on the turn. Okay, that's weird. Why would I want to I guess I guess I could use that. But when would I want to? We've got three packs after this. What are we gonna get? Uh, we got an Aetherborn Marauder, Servant of the Conduits, Morbid Curiosity, and an Adventure's Fair. Don't even care what it says. Three packs left. Are we going to get anything that I want out of this box? Not a single invention, which is kind of sad. You'd think you'd get at least one invention in a box. Uh, Oval Chase Daredevil, another Brawler, Console Sheer Guard, and... Ooh, Bomb or Dombin Ban. Okay, so we did get a, a Planeswalker. Okay, so I can't say I didn't get a Planeswalker. It's just not what I wanted. That's three dollars. Okay, what do we got? Until your next turn, up to one target creature gets minus three, minus zero, and it's activated. Those can't be activated. Okay, minus one. Draw, uh, you gain two life. Draw a card. Minus seven. You get an emblem with your opponents can't untap more than two permanents during their untap. Oh damn. Okay, that's useful. All right, two packs left. Oh, this pack doesn't want to open. Then we got we got one planeswalker. It's not what the one I wanted, but meh, I'm not gonna argue. Uh, let's see, Arbor Back Stomper, Contraband Kingpin, Gear Shift Ace, and another Authority of Consoles. Okay, I mean that's a pretty sweet card. All right, last pack of Kaladesh. 
Probably not going to order any more Kaladesh after this. What do we got in the pack? Fairground Warden, Aether Hub, Console Surveillance, and Animated Module. Uh, whenever one or more plus one plus one counters are placed on a permanent you control, you may pay one. If you do, create a one one color server artifact token. Okay. Choose a counter on target permanent or player. Give that permanent or player another counter of that kind. Okay. And a foil ruinous gremlins. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Let's do a quick recap of what we got. Da, 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 da. I'll put those on the bottom. Quick recap. Uh, we got a foil arena scramblings, foil impeccable timing, foil mall, mall fist door buster, foil makes obsolete, foil built to smash, foil authority of the consoles, a foil forge, a fire forge puzzle knot, an abomination mo or an animation module, authority of the consoles, inventors fair, multiform wonder, aether storm rock, spire bluff canal, deadlock trap, uh, sage life crafter. It's a long word. Gonti Lord of Luxury, which is pretty sweet. It's a pretty boss card. Panharmonica, Madcap Experiments, Lost Legacy, Cultivator of Blades, Scrap Heap Scounder, I don't know, I might use this, might not. Captive uh, by the Consulate, Master Tinkerer, Skyship Stalker, Pan uh, Patium, Console of Innovation, Bombat Carrier, Insidious Will, Confiscation Coop, Coop, Cultivator Caravan, The Ornery, A Bristling Hydra, Dubious Challenge, Fumigate. A, uh, oh, yeah, we did get a Botanical Sanctum, which is worth five bucks. Fateful Showdown, Inspiring Vantage, Territorial Gorger, Electrostatic Pummeler, uh, Fleet Wheel Cruiser, we got a Dovin, uh, Dovin Bond, Etherworks Marvel, Angel of Innovation, which is pretty nice, or to mention, and Torrential Gear Hulk. So at least we got the Torrential Gear Hulk to kind of round out the box. I didn't get really what I was looking for, but not a big problem. Anyways, tune in next week. We're going to open uh, Aether Revolt, and hopefully we get a good luck. I always never really got good luck with Aether Revolt, but we got a whole box. We're just going to go through it. And, uh, yeah, have a great day. See you all around.